we've got a two-part finale, starting with a battle between Byron and Sarah. They have to draw a little inspiration from the location of this week's elimination challenge, which is Portland's Japanese Garden. So for this challenge, I want to see your take on the bento box. Each of them has to create a bento box with four different components, a meat or fish component, a rice component, a vegetable component, and a pickled component. Japanese cuisine is not a style of cooking that Byron does very often. So I think he really wanted to showcase that he could do a, a different style of food. That's working out beautifully. Japanese cuisine is known for refinement and simplicity and really honoring ingredients. And that was part of the challenge. And chefs, I know you came in here thinking you were doing a quick fire, but obviously that's not what you're doing. What are we doing? Oh. We're hanging out watching. Oh. 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 <laughs> Both. Byron and Sarah created two pretty beautiful bento boxes. Byron's was a little bit more sort of traditional and simple. Tom had some great things to say about his dish. He really found his flavors simple but refined, a lot of nuance in it. And that's not easy to do with four components in a 30 minute time period. The winning bento box belongs to Byron. So Byron, you earned a chance to get back to the competition, but you are not there yet.